I think we all need to be concerned about low-hanging wires on West Wayne Avenue and all these extra wires that have been left up there on the telephone poles over the years. And I mean low-hanging. I mean low-hanging. See them hanging loopy underneath the trail bridge? I know this is a... I guess it's a, a wire that holds up the other wires. It's now all the way down here. Obviously only about five feet off the ground. Goes up to the other wires where it's unspooling. However, the guys from Grand Rapids who fixed the wires after Isabel told me never to touch any hanging wire, even if it didn't appear to be an electric wire, because somewhere along the line it could be laying on a charged wire. Notice how low these wires are? This should not be acceptable for public safety. This doesn't look right across from St. George Hunt's office. I think this wire blew here and no one's repaired it. They just put another one up maybe. If you continue down the line, you can see that it too is looping down. More wires are looping down across from Vic and Dean's. There's a lot of wires up here. I know that they never take wires down when they put new wires up. And I think that there comes a point where some of the old wires need to be taken down before they fall down. Both telephone poles at Ordericio have the metal, I don't know what kind of wire it is, um, coming down from the overhead wires and laying on the ground. Again, the guys from Grand Rapids after Isabel said, do not touch any of these wires. Because somewhere along the line, they could be laying on a charged wire. Well, someone's touched this one because they've neatly wound it around the big rock. Um, there's another one further down at the next um, telephone pole. I think that's a cable wire though. I think these wires that run along West Wayne need to be looked at. I think the ones that are not in use should be removed and the ones that are in use should be properly rehung.